growth hormone injections banned in professional sports, even GH analogs and secretagogues get flagged by anti-doping agencies. That alone should tell you how powerful this hormone really is. But here's the part people miss. Growth hormone isn't just for athletes trying to get shredded or bodybuilders chasing size. It matters for you. Yes, you watching this right now because it impacts fat loss, muscle recovery, deep sleep, energy levels, and even your testosterone. While testosterone gets all the spotlight, GH is like the silent weapon working behind the scenes. In this video, I'll walk you through exactly how growth hormone works, why it matters for your health and masculinity, the hidden dangers of synthetic GH injections, and most importantly, how to naturally optimize your own GH levels. Stick around to the end for a clear, no fluff, step-by-step -step plan that actually works. Let's get into it. Growth hormone GH, also known as somatotropin, is a peptide hormone made in your pituitary gland. Its main job? Tell your body to grow, repair and recover. Here's a science simplified. The hypothalamus sends a signal called GHRH, growth hormone releasing hormone, to your pituitary gland. That's the green light to release GH. But there's also a red light, somatostatin, which puts the brakes on GH when needed. Now, GH is released in pulses, not constantly. These pulses happen mostly at night, especially during deep sleep. When you're getting quality shut eye, your body says, all right, let's send out a GH burst to repair the damage, burn fat and build you back better. Here's what those pulses do. Burn fat, lipolysis, preserve muscle, regenerate skin and tissues, strengthen bones, regulate blood sugar, improve sleep quality, support testosterone production. So this isn't just about looking good, GH plays a critical role in how you feel, function and recover. And unlike testosterone which gets all the attention, GH works quietly in the background. But here's a twist, the teammates, not rivals. GH versus testosterone, what's the difference? Think of testosterone as the daytime warrior, it builds muscle, powers your drive, sharpens your focus, boosts libido and makes you feel like a man. Growth hormone, that's your overnight repair system. It helps your body patch up the damage, regenerate tissue and prepare for the next day's battle. Daytime equals testosterone, nighttime equals growth hormone. When you boost one, the other often follows. Studies show a clear relationship when testosterone rises, GH levels often increase too, and vice versa. Low GH is frequently found in men with low T. This is why optimizing GH naturally can give your testosterone a leg up and help you recover faster, burn more fat and sleep like a king. Let's also not forget testosterone and GH both decline with age, but that doesn't mean you're doomed. It means you need to get smarter with your lifestyle. The hidden dangers of injecting GH. Now, you might be thinking, why not just inject it? Well, let's talk about that. Yes, synthetic GH injections can lead to faster muscle recovery better sleep, less body fat, improved skin and joint health. But they come with serious risks. Insulin resistance, hello prediabetes, carpal tunnel syndrome, facial bone growth, your jaw and forehead literally change shape, organ enlargement, yes, including your heart, higher cancer risk, if your cancer cells already exist. And let's not forget, it's illegal without prescription in many countries. This means that obtaining growth hormone without proper medical oversight is not only risky, but also against the law. Many people turn to the black market to get their hands on GH, but that comes with a whole host of problems. The black market GH is often fake, underdosed, or contaminated with harmful substances. You might think you're getting the real deal, but instead, you could be injecting harmful counterfeit products that do more harm than good. These fake products can contain impurities, improper dosages, or even dangerous additives that can cause serious health problems. The lack of quality control and regulation in underground markets means you have no guarantee of what's actually going into your body. This makes the risk of side effects, infections, and long-term damage significantly higher. So not only is it illegal and unethical, but it can also be incredibly unsafe. A quick warning about fake GH. Many people believe they're purchasing authentic growth hormone, the 1901 amino acid sequence, 
that is bioidentical to what your body naturally produces. However, what's often sold instead are variants with the 192 amino acids. That seemingly small difference is huge biologically because that one extra amino acid makes the hormone foreign to your body's immune system. When your immune system detects this foreign substance, it can start producing antibodies to attack it. The problem is, these antibodies may not only target the fake GH, but also the natural GH your body produces, effectively neutralizing its effects. Over time, this can make you resistant to growth hormone therapy altogether, meaning your body becomes less responsive to its own natural hormone signals. This immune reaction can lead to a cascade of issues, including decreased recovery, poor fat loss, and impaired tissue repair. You're not just throwing away money by buying counterfeit products, you could be actively sabotaging your hormonal health. That's why you need to be extremely cautious if you're considering GH therapy always do so under the supervision of a qualified healthcare professional who can provide genuine medically approved products and monitor your health closely. Unless you're a millionaire celebrity with a top tier anti-aging doctor monitoring your blood work weekly, this route is a gamble. But here's the good news. You don't need needles, you just need the right strategy to unlock your body's natural GH spikes for free. Let's break that down next. What controls growth hormone release? GH is like a light switch turned on and off by specific triggers and inhibitors. Deep sleep, especially between 10 p.m. and 2 a.m., fasting low blood sugar states, high intensity exercise, testosterone and estrogen, yes, a bit of estrogen helps too, ghrelin, the hunger hormone, amino acids, especially L-arginine, inhibitors, high insulin from frequent snacking and late night eating, chronic stress, high cortisol, poor sleep, sleep deprivation, sedentary lifestyle, high IGF-1 feedback loop. In short, G hit spikes when you're fasted, under physical stress, or asleep in a deep restful state. Your body releases it to say, let's repair and adapt. So if you're constantly eating, skipping workouts and scrolling TikTok till 1am, you're killing your GH. Time to reverse that. Ways to naturally boost GH levels. Let's go deep on what actually works. Here are eight powerful science-backed strategies to naturally elevate your GH. One, sleep before 10 p.m. Sleep is your GH supercharger. Over 70% of your GH release happens in the early sleep window, roughly 10 p.m. to 2 a.m. So if you're staying up watching Netflix till midnight, you're missing out. Black out your room, lower the temperature around 18 degrees is ideal. Stop eating two to three hours before bed. Avoid screens before sleep. This one change could double your GH levels within a week. Two, fast smartly. Fasting is one of the most potent GH boosters. 24 hour fast equals 300% increase in GH. 48 hour fast equal up to 1200% increase, but you don't need to be extreme. If 48 hour fast equals up to 1200% increase, but you don't need extreme fasting. A simple 16 to 8 intermittent fasting protocol, for example, eating from 12 p.m. to 8 p.m. is enough to lower insulin and let GH do its job. And GH also preserves muscle while fasting, a win-win. Three, train with intensity. Not all workouts are equal. GH responds to intensity, sprints, compound lifts, squats, deadlifts, overhead presses, high intensity interval training, push hard, short rest periods, go close to failure, for even more benefit, train fasted in the morning. Four, supplement wisely. A few supplements actually stimulate GH release when used properly. L-arginine, five to nine grams, reduces stomatostatin, boosting GH. GABA, three grams, may increase GH by up to 400% at night. Glycine, three grams, improves sleep and indirectly raises GH. Niacin, vitamin B3, 500 milligrams, triggers GH release. Cycle these, don't take them daily for months on end, use for two to four weeks, then take a break. Five, Eat GH-friendly foods, prioritize high-protein foods, eggs, grass-fed beef, salmon, healthy fats, avocados, olive oil, nuts, greens, spinach, kale. Avoid sugar, especially before bed, processed carbs, snacking at night, raises insulin, which then lowers GH. Six, lower cortisol, high cortisol, 
kills GH. Combat it with meditation, walking in nature, journaling, cold showers, sauna. You can't be in a constant fight or flight mode and expect to recover or grow. Seven, boost testosterone. GH and testosterone work hand in hand. Lift heavy, get sunlight. Vitamin D3 is a natural tea booster. Avoid seed oils, minimize plastics, pH, phthalates. These all increase estrogen. Optimize testosterone and GH tends to rise with it. Eight, get lean. Body fat suppresses GH and the more visceral fat you carry, the more estrogen your body makes. Aim for 15% body fat. How? Use some of the steps that I've just mentioned. GH will help you lose fat and losing fat will boost GH. It's a powerful loop. GH and IGF-1, the recovery duo. GH does a lot, but one of its most important jobs is telling your liver to produce IGF-1, insulin-like growth factor one. IGF-1 handles the actual muscle building, skin repair, and fat burning. GH is a messenger. IGF-1 is the action taker. Low GH means low IGF-1, and low IGF-1 means poor recovery, less muscle, and slower fat loss. That's why when you optimize GH naturally, you're also improving your IGF-1 axis. Let's wrap it up with the growth hormone activation plan. Sleep by 10 p.m., blackout curtains, cold room, no food late, fast 14 to 16 hours a day, give your body time to enter a low insulin state, train intensely, faster training with compound lifts, use smart supplements, L-arginine, GABA, glycine, niacin, eat clean, proteins, greens, fats, no sugar at night, manage stress, cold showers, journaling, sauna, nature walks, boost testosterone, lift, get sunlight, avoid estrogenic toxins, get lean, under 15% body fat, unlocks your hormonal potential. Do this consistently and you'll unlock your natural growth hormone spikes without needles, drugs, or risks. Your fat loss, recovery, and sleep and masculinity will thank you. Remember to smash that like button, hit subscribe, and thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.